story time with me. Now I want to read you Santa's secret. My parents had planned an adventure one day. We loaded the car and went on our way. We sent Christmas carols to grandmother's delight till we got to the city of festivals and bright and a parentage in a pear tree. The, s- the sidewalks were packed but we made our way through and I climbed on that shoulder to get the best view a holiday a holiday with marching band playing and floats on displays. Santa came into sight and the cheering grew loud from a shiny red sleigh. He waved to the crowd. When the parade ended, we walked for a while and who did we See with a bell and with and with a smile. He wrote he he wore the same suit but I knew right away he wasn't the Santa I had seen in the sleigh. That's not the same Santa, I loudly declared. The people nearby turned toward me and stared. Mama said Santa needs helpers to get the job done, but I demanded to know who was the real one. Grandma leaned down with answers for me. It's Santa's secret, just as it should be. But everyone knows that Santa's secret won't out. I'd, I'd uncover the truth. I had I hadn't a doubt. We we found Santa's station and wanted and waited in line until family thank goodness the next turn was mine. His beard was as white as fresh falcon snow, and his belly jiggled with each. Ho, ho, ho! I had questions for Santa. I would see what he knew about reindeer and elves and the rest of the crew. I got out my notebook and I would crack this case wide. From a good detective, the truth cannot hide. What is your name? I started with him. I started off with simple on each side of the screen. I noticed a dimple. Basher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, and Blitz. Who are your reindeers? What do they eat? And does Rato have a favorite treat? Do you? Do your reindeer sleep? Where do you live? Who helps you decide what presents to give? Do you like to fly? Do you like to take vacations? Tell me a few of your favorite locations. How big is your workshop? How many elves do they live in? How many? How many elves do they live with you or all of them by themselves? Well, of of the some elves live with me. I know there are a few who live in the village and communicate to work. I had to be through to get to the truth. I recorded his answers like any great I paused for a moment and looked in his eyes. This question would catch him by surprise. Are you the one? Are you for real 
Do you like being Santa? How does it feel? Santa Claus chuckled, and his reply was tug of his beard and a wink of his eye. Then he patted his, my head and had a question from what what is it what is it you like beneath your tree? I thought my investigation should persist, but I thanked him instead and gave him my list. We settled into a warm coffee shop. Hot cocoa for me with marshmallows on top. Looking over my notes, did I have enough? Could I solve the case or was it too tough? But then, catching my eye, tucked back in a nook, sitting by himself, reading a book, was a man with, with a beard, his coat on the chair. I couldn't help it but to stare. He munched on a cookie and sipped on a drink. There was something about him. I did not dare blink. You know, but with no with not pad in hand, excuse me, I said. I saw that his cheeks were bright cherry red, his smile stretched up and crinkled his eyes, and then without asking to my surprise, he said, Reindeer like barely and berries to eat, but carrots had he added are their favorite treat. I turned towards Mama for a second, I swear, and when I turned back, the man wasn't there. I had seen a few Santas, though the day that I met the real one, this sleuth can't not say Grandma is right, as it should be. So I'll keep Santa's secret. It's safe with me. Hope you like this story, guys. Bye.